This is Louisiana. You'll notice here, for this entire area here, this green area. We're testing for the hydrocarbons in the water and the dispersants. Literally, at this point, thousands of tests have been run. One shrimp sample. Not a single one has reached a level of, of concern for human health. The fraud is that they hire laboratories who set artificially high minimum detection levels. Let's say that background is five parts per billion of a chemical. They set the sensitivity at 20. So when all the tests come back, it says nine detect, nine detect, nine detect. They needed to detect 10 to 15. That's how they do it. To open, there is very, very rigorous bar to pass. One, there has to be no visible oil in those areas. And we know that visible oil is, is one thing, but what else may be there? Uh, the other is uh, sensory analysis, or our sniffers. Uh, they got us smelling it to see if it's all right. NOAA actually has certified sniffers, people who, who sniff. Are they smelling them, and that's, they consider that a test? There's different levels of sniffers. The first level, second level, and people who are very highly trained sniffers. Well, that's a joke. And so here in Louisiana, they've trained up some of our local state personnel to be sniffers. They sent us stuff around the room to smell stuff and try to figure out what it was. Sniffing is actually an established way of looking at the quality of seafood. We had to guess, you know, which one had five parts per million, which one had ten parts per million, and which one was corrective and which one was uh, BP oil. Mm -hmm.